Dan Perkins, Jasper County, Indiana, cover crop guy. We are in a field north of Rensselaer, Indiana, and we have some cover crop strips out here, but what I wanted to show today was the what you don't want your radish uh, field to look like if you have radishes in your mix. And what you have here is radish that's sending up seed heads. And what happened in this field is, this isn't supposed to be like this, but wild seed or wild radish got somehow mixed in to this mix. And so it's sending up seed heads within about two and a half, three weeks. And that is uh, not a good thing, largely because what you have happening is you don't have a radish forming uh, that deep root, sending out a lot of side, uh, side roots that are really where you get a majority of your benefit. Um, and what you want is a radish that looks like this. It's nice and big around the base. It's got a, a tuber that's coming up. Um, and it will continue to build depth and build root mass. Because that's where a lot of your benefit is in terms of feeding your soil biology, holding on to your nitrogen. Whereas this plant, biologically, it's going to stop rooting and put all its energy into the top part of that seed production, just like you would a corn plant um, when it starts filling the, the kernel. Here's what you want your radishes to look like. This is a another variety that was just planted by itself in a strip, and none of this uh, is going to seed, and that's exactly what you want. Dan Perkins, Jasper County, Soil and Water, Cover Crop Guy.